I wonder why I put a save, considering it doesn't really matter, but here we are. Hey there, everyone, this is Algal playing the judge judging zone levels made for Maggle 4. Come here, go to level 4. Yeah, so these were the additions, so basically, you know, pro prospering judges would be like, well, play these five levels and let's see what your judging looks like. Uh, I've done two. This, I've been told, is by far the hardest one, and Xfix, at the very least, is pretty confident I'll be able to do the three remaining ones uh, right now today. Let's find out. Horror of Lava. That is pretty horrifying. <laughs> okay. Hey, this is that one, huh? Is it just... Yeah, it's just water. <laughs> has there ever has there ever been a make a good yump level before? Like just a I feel like a make a bad level contest could be a lot of fun. It's just that a lot of it would veer into Kaizo not fun, super hard. <laughs> I love this though. <laughs> it's so cute. It's your little button. Alright, alright, alright. In season athletic. Let's see what happens right now. Alright, so athletic, you know, it might be a platformy level. Ooh, this is just me or these are a lot faster. I think they are. Alright, that guy lives in a pipe. Red stem, though, so someone's gonna complain. Uh, uh, yeah, those are mouth sounds. Okay, that guy's there. Oh, I did that bad. I, well, yeah, you need to give yourself a little bit of a running start. I basically did the jump from a standstill. What do you think's gonna happen? Cheerios. See, just do that. Like, oh, watch out. Okay, red block probably hurt. Just, whoop. Just a feeling I have. It's very subtle feeling. Just one fireball. That's weird. You're weirding me out here, buddy. All right, just kind of write it down. Here we go. Yeah, I got ambushed. It's not so much that I got ambushed, so much that I like kind of jumped for no reason that one time. Man, these single-shot plants... I don't know. There's something, like, very unthreatening about them. So to get there, you just do that. Simple. I don't know if I can get that flat... Work. Maybe one... I don't need it, though. Let's assume that it basically exists to be a carnival barker. Or, in other news, a mushroom when you, you know, respawn from the midpoint. Ridiculous, I'm aware. Single shot guy. I love my new single shot guy. Oh, what? Oh, you just went up. All right. That's fair. Is it? Uh, sure. I've had much less fair. All right. You are, like, time kind of not great for me and my bologna sandwiches. All right. Jump over everything. Did it. You shot. Whoa, no! I overshot! <laughs> How did I manage that? Yeah, he's just kind of going up and down his peach-colored pipe, but he's very good at it. Alright, so that's where I got hurt last time. And I still got hurt this time. Last Agadon! Oh! So, okay, so it's a meaningful red stem. It's a lost level red stem. We just kind of keep going up whenever. Okay. You are really, really safe, though. Spit guy, spit and fly. All right, so I got all the Dagadon just in separate lives. Oh, what? All right. Don't touch those lips. Let's go. This is probably one of the harder part. If I could get him to spit, okay, do that. Go over the fire, not under. Simple. And yet, simple. I feel like just spin jumping on you when you're fully out might have been actually the easiest way through there. Alright, let's just go. 
that guy's there. There you go. Perfect. That's exactly what I want to see. I just kind of went. Oh, wait. Okay, I... Did I miscount my Dagadons? Sure is looking like that. I, I thought uh, that was five, the one that, where I declared I got all of them. <laughs> yes, I miscounted. That's on me. Oh, this level is nice. It's a pretty straightforward jumpy level. Like, it's honestly pretty good. Um, I'm not sure where it would rank in the contest. I know that's not the purpose, but I don't know, there's something, it's night. Nice. Like, it's interesting. It feels like something you'd encounter in like a early Luigi's adventure or something. I like that. It, it won't change the world, but it's pretty fun to just kind of bop and bop. Ninja Citadel, this is how we're gonna close off the whole Maggle 4 adventure. Oh. That. Oh, they jump when I jump. They're little like the squeaks. Got it. So you go, you go like woof. You go like woof and then you woof. You woof and you woof and then you die. Yeah. Time oh, that's funny. <laughs> I don't think we've encountered that glitch at any point in the contest. Where you know it's just that because like like so the way smooth works. In case you don't know, I don't know why I'm the one teaching you this right now at this point. But you know, Smoo is just like, well, how's this gonna work? Cause you know, like, it's just when you die, like, it doesn't know that you timed over. It's, I'm not sure how to do this. No, I just jump with them. Oh, I was overcomplicating that completely. Yeah, 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 you just jump with them, of course. Ooh. Ooh. Yeah, 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 yeah. That swim is huge. Anyways, yeah, so press a button and die. There you go. No, it's like like the game doesn't know you time over. It's just that it look when you die, it looks where the timer is at. And if it's at zero, then it's like, oh well, I guess I guess you time over. The... There we go. That's the end of that story. Alright, just go here, we do a little bit of that. Yeah, you take a little bit of a swim. There we go. This is very, uh, jump one style. <laughs> oh, you scared me. Yeah, that's why you're here. You're not, you're, yeah, you're going to stop my, the rock. There we go, rock station. Okay, so I need to, yeah, jump in such a way that blue shoes here can do that. There we go. He's very happy. I'm very happy. I just... Ah, uh, I wasn't looking at that guy in particular, and now I'm timed out. Up. Pressed uh, right too quickly. <laughs> I don't know what I was doing. Honestly, like, emphasize survival. Okay, should be good. There we go. Even died. Sneak in here. I died right at the midpoint. What a thought. What a clever ideal. What a planet Saturn. Ooh, auto scroll. When you see blue coins, stop jumping. If not one of those pesky ninjas will block your path. So no jumps? Is this a... Well, I mean... Do I have to jump? Uh, or is it... Like, once I'm past those coins and I can't jump? Or maybe on the auto scroll, you're supposed to be way more in advance than that. There's like a few ways to interpret everything. All the information that's been thrown my way. Let's find out together. Whoosh. 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 Alright, so let's just do that. Alright, at this point, we're not jumping. Yeah, see, because we gotta get let that guy do that. And then it's like, whoosh, slow down. And then I died. <laughs> That's the story. See, now it makes sense. Now that I see this. Alright, so. Alright, so at this point, I could re jump. Well, here I have to jump. Here I gotta run after the saws. Here I gotta not die. If I can help it. Whoa, real? Oh, if I had normal jump, I think it would have been okay.
Right, double spray. Well, see, it was like three, so I figured it'd be a double double. Ha, ah, again. No, I, sorry. Do that. That's all. That's all you need to do. Then here you rush. Right. Observe. Observed. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> There's the moon. Uh, yeah, that's not how you get that. You need to bounce on it, right? I, I didn't do that. I just destroyed the poor ninja. It's the little cute. It's like a. Uh... It has that. I feel like when people describe jump flavor, like, that's what they think about. It's not quite accurate, but it's kind of that sort of, like, overall category. I thought it was cute. Like, clearly it needs somewhere. It's a... It's a sort of like a, a, an earlier interpretation of that style level building. But I thought it was adorable. I know you do a little, like, vanilla style no jump challenge get fit in there. Like, that's neat. It feels very makeshift, like, the way that you have to, like, do these weird constructions to make these gimmick work in Mario Maker, that's the vibe I get. Uh, this was really cool, it was really neat. I... I loved everything I played here, even yesterday's trouble spot, like, I get what they were going for. It was still some charm to it. Man, oh man, oh man, ah. See, not playing smooth for a bit and then playing this makes me realize how much I miss playing smooth. But could you not make the argument that then I should keep long pauses between smooth so that I keep appreciating the smooths? This is the kind of thing you gotta think about. But point is, though, is that coming up next, we're playing Raumac! But not the type you're thinking of.